Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel, and as you know, it is spooky season, so expect some horror-filled games on this channel. I cannot wait to show y'all. Also, sorry for this weird angle, but I got a new monitor, and I can't seem to level it down to my, to my, uh, head, so... It's, this is gonna have to stick, I'm sorry guys. But it's fine guys, because today we'll be playing Fears to Fathom Woodbury Getaway. What a great start to our October spooky season. I'm not gonna hold y'all anymore. If you do find yourself liking this video and if you do want more spooky horror games, please comment, subscribe, like, share, burn it, do whatever you want, it's greatly appreciated. And let's get on with this game. Needed coffee to get done with the, wait, what? Needed coffee to get done with the day. Ma'am, I think you got it mixed up. <laughs> like, why do you need to wake up to get done with the day? Unless you got more work to do, then yeah, that's, that's tough. And it looks like it's like 3 a.m. or something, bro. I should be home, enjoying my life. But I'm here, trying to pay bills. Ah, uh, felt. As much as I wanted to leave, I needed a cup of coffee. Okay, girl really need that cup of coffee. Okay, I'm getting it. Sorry, I just, where's, where's the break room? Okay, we found it. We found the coffee machine. Get the cup. It needed water. Oh, sorry. See, I'm so tired from work, I just, just slipped my mind. Uh, yeah. Hands were full. Do we have one hand or something? Cause it doesn't look like your other hand is busy. I guess, well, I guess we, <sighs> I must be really tired. I'm sorry. Let me just, ooh, okay. What? I thought I heard something, bro. This is not good. Actually, I think I am hearing some noises. I never had coffee without creamer. Amen. I needed to put a li- Are you on break? Cause there ain't no way you got time to put a lid on it. Like, just drink the coffee. I guess we're trying to be extra. Mmm. Delicious. Needed to use the re You just got coffee. What are we gonna do with the coffee? We gonna throw it away? I guess we're not done um, with it. This is kind of awkward. I was done with it. Okay, finally. Uh, ooh. Okay, sorry. This is just not my night. You know, one more try and, and it's stand on the floor. That's close enough. I did. Is there someone over there? I hear noises. Hey, what's up? What do you want, Sid? I'm trying to get this done. I was just checking if you needed anything. Why is your head like that? Damn. Can't these clients ever make up their minds? I know, I hate them too. What keeps you here so late again? Just wrapping up. Damn. Have fun. That might be us in the near future. Okay. Oh. What? Am I not a man? Okay. Maybe I'm a woman. Wow, this is great. Um, see how disgusting this bathroom is? This is gross. And it's like the company doesn't have money to spruce up the bathroom. Is that like rust or... I'm not gonna even say the other thing that, I, that it might be. We're not doing that today. Uh,
There was no one in the office except for that man. So who could... Whatever. Whatever. We're not going to worry about it. Maybe it's just our measurement. <laughs> Yo! No! 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 And you're in my face. Have you heard of personal space before, sir? This is not the way to do it. This is not the way to talk to me. <sighs> Whoa, ma'am, sorry. Didn't know anyone was in here. You almost gave me a heart attack. I'm so sorry. Should have knocked before I came in, but there isn't anyone usually here this late. It's not fine. <laughs> Again, I'm sorry. I usually do knock, but I'm a little bit frustrated tonight. Hus has slipped my mind. What's got you so frustrated, sir? I don't understand. Someone keeps throwing coffee cups on the floor. I made it. I made it in the trash can. Couldn't be talking about me. All over the floor in the office. It's been happening for weeks. Yeah, that's really rude. I'm sorry you have to deal with that, sir. Well, I need to get back to it. Don't want to be here all night. Picking up coffee cups. Have a good night. Uh, yeah. Hey, hey, what? Don't look at me. That was not me. I made it into the trash can. Almost into the trash can. Eh, fine without drying my hair. <gasps> Bro! Mm -mm. I need to get out of here. I need to get out of here. It's time to clock off. I'm not dealing with this crap today. Mm, now the telephone rings. Like Spongebob. This ain't good. Um. Okay. Hello? Hey, Orp, it's Mike. Hi, Mike. I've been trying to call your cell for the last two hours. It just keeps going to voicemail. Is everything all right? I'm at work. I'm pretty sure phones aren't allowed on the call floor. Um, mm. Yeah, my phone's been acting up lately. Oh, snap. I was starting to think maybe you were ignoring me. <laughs> uh. Um, I'm not going to say anything to that, sir. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um. Not making this any better, Mike. Uh, anyway, uh... What are you still doing at work? It's getting kind of late. Are you my father or something? Like, I'm just trying to get a bag. Work's been overwhelming uh, lately, yeah. Damn, Art, that sounds rough. Good thing I called to cheer you up. <laughs> I can't, I don't even have a choice to say anything to that. It's just pure silence, like, sure, Mike, whatever you want. Um, about our trip, did you get a chance to book the rental house? just really wanted to see you. And Nora. Okay, what's our relationship with Mike? Because it just seems like we're not really... We're not friends. Um, we're, we're friends, but not to him. We might be something, something more, potentially. Um, which is sad, because I'm not getting good vibes from Mike. No. You seem a bit annoyed about me calling. Seriously, Harper, this is a bad time. It's just how I usually talk, bro. Mike, come on. I'll do it now. That's the Sydney Harper I know. I'm sorry if I was being pushy. I'm just struggling a little lately. Very much so. No worries, Harper. I don't want to stress you out. As long as you book it tonight, I think it'll be fine. Okay, great, Mike. Can I get back to my work? Hey. I was thinking, since we both live in the city, maybe I could pick you up and ride together. It'd be nice to catch up. No, I think I can get an Uber. You no, know, save on gas and relive the good old days. Just a little bit of Mike and Sydney time before Nora gets there. What What does Mike and Sydney time mean, Mike? Are you trying to, uh, you know, get some uh, dessert before... We get to the rental house, because it's not happening. It's not. And I love how there's no, no, or we'll get an Uber, 
or hell no that I can choose. Um, sure. Great. Uh, I guess I'll let you get back to work then. Okay, thanks. Oh, uh, wait, one more thing. What is it, Mike? When you book the rental, please make sure to keep it under $100 a night. In 2024? Mike, what year is this? Because there ain't no building, no house that's under $100 a night. We're going to be living in a cardboard mansion soon. Nora and I were talking, and she's been on a pretty tight budget. Things haven't been going very well for her. Jo join the club. Hang up. That's... I'm not that cold, bro. It'll be just like the old college days. You always had a knack for finding the best spots. We're not gonna ask what that means. I really should be making the booking now. Right, right, of course. Sorry for yapping. I'm just excited, I guess. Please stop. All right, talk to you later, Harp. Hang up. Okay, great. Now, uh... Ooh. I don't know what any of this means. Type invader? Wait, wait, wait a second. This is my favorite, all-time favorite game. What do I do? Oh, oh, this is a typing game. Oh, shit. Wait, wait, I'm not ready. I'm doing pretty good for someone that wasn't ready. Okay, okay. That's all you got, bro? Go back to your planet. We don't want you here. Frick. Leave me alone. Leave. Leave. 40? I was just at 100 HP. It's fine. What is that? What? What are these long ass words? And they're so close to me. 92% accuracy is pretty good though. I, I don't care. Okay, let's let's exit. Let's uh I guess browser. My favorite website. Oh, it's one of those. Okay, whatever. I guess she won't figure out my favorite website then. It's fine. Feeling unlucky. Oh, can't do that. Where are you going? Hell. Up. Woodbury. What a twist. 300. Yeah, those are the those are the prices. Normal prices here. Mm. That is a nice place, though. There ain't no way that trailer park is 249 a night. That looks pretty good, too, but it's giving, um, you know, country, giving I wouldn't be welcome there, so we're not gonna, we're not gonna look at it. Oh, look! One for $99! Private cabin in Woodbury. Two reviews! That's a red flag if I ever saw one before. Yikes. 259. Yep, that's the only one that we can get, so uh, let's not waste any time. I can't believe we're doing this on a company computer. Like, we're gonna get fired so quick. Thanks. When I was in my early 20s, I worked at a big consulting firm in my city. Life at the firm, uh, uh, wow. Life at the firm was a consistent juggle of deadlines, client meetings, and trying to prove my worth. Fun, which didn't leave much room for leisure, let alone a social life. The job paid well, sure, but at the expense of my mental peace. That's not good, Harper. I'm Sydney Harper. And this story takes place during one of those days. I told you, it's one of those days, man. 
One of my college friends, Mike, suggested that we take a weekend getaway to rural Vermont. Friends, friends, Mike, which sounded like a perfect break from the cycle of work. And my other friend, Nora, was quick to jump on board as well. The plan was simple. We rent a small cabin, close our shift early on Friday, leave and be back on Monday. Mike came to pick me up. Thanks, Mike. It's not like I couldn't take a Uber. Oh God, hi. Afternoon, quite chilly today, eh? Nod, uh-huh. I've seen you around, but haven't had a chance to introduce myself. I'm Gail. Um, I don't trust you, Gail, not gonna lie. How does he know all this? You're on the 10th floor, right? I'm on the 8th. How do you know? I've just seen you a few times getting off at the 10th floor when I'm home late from work. What do you do for work? Me? I'm a software engineer. What about you? Anyways, I hope you have a great rest of your day. I need to get some groceries before the snow starts. You too, sir. Um, I don't want I forgot my suitcase. Whoa, wait, bro, bro, bro. I got, I got my stuff in there. I, how do I, how do I answer? I know how to answer the phone. I just hung up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mike. Um, <clears throat> pulling into the parking garage now. You downstairs yet? I think I see you, Mike. Let's, let's get a look at you. Hi, Mike. My suitcase just fell. <laughs> Thanks, Mike. Harp. Hug. I mean, we are friends. Sure. That's still... You're not... You're not making a good impression, Mike. I'm trying to be as nice as I possibly can. What voice should I give him? That's, that's still how you hug people? Why don't you hug me like you missed me? Cause I didn't, I didn't miss you at all. Um, let's just keep it light, you know? Just a test hug to see if he smelled first. Fair enough, but for the record, I showered just for the occasion. Nothing is too good for Sydney Harper. No, you don't get a second hug. You can just throw your stuff in the back and we'll get on our way. Great. Um, thanks. Oh, okay. All right then, Harp. Are you ready to hit the road? Let's do this. Sure, why not? Um, okay. Yeah, it is your pickup truck. Four twenty six PM. Okay. Oh, this is beautiful. It was starting to snow. Okay. Yeah, this is pretty nice. Oh. Harp. Isn't it weird? We used to dream about escaping our college, and now here we are. Okay, we're getting deep. Trying to escape from the life we wanted to live. A lot of people feel that way. Funny how that works. Change is just hard. Like trying to adjust to the new job. How's your new job going so far? We're working on this project that uses machine learning to predict marketing trends Oh shit, um, to predict market trends. It's pretty cutting edge stuff. It's pretty cutting edge stuff. Okay, read it right, whatever. Uh, sounds like you're shaping the future. Not quite Tony Stark yet, but I'll take it. Oh, okay, let me, let me 
me check. Can I check the message? You know, uh, I never understood. What do consultants even do? We consult. That sounds like... Oh! <laughs> Did you see that school bus? See what? There was a school bus back by the old house. Maybe it's project. You know, someone's idea of turning it into a tiny home on wheels or something? I've read people do that on the internet. A lot of people do a lot of things on the internet, Mike. Okay, let me, uh... Let me check. It's nearly 5 p.m. and I haven't received a confirmation text from you. I just wanted to check. That was close, yeah. You know, I read on the internet. You know, Mike, you just need to get off the internet. That's, that's your problem. That's your problem right there. That in Native American lore, Seeing a deer cross your path is like getting a message from the universe. You know... I don't really have anything to say to that, Mike. Can I, can I check my message? We're on our way and should be there around 6 p.m. The snow slowed us down quite uh, a bit. Thanks for checking in. Okay, please confirm when you check in and travel safe. Thanks. Rick seems like a good person. A good Airbnb host. Uh, how far is it now? Should be about an hour and a half from here. You know, driving through the snow kind of feels like we're... Just drive. Stop. Stop it. I don't, I don't even know how we're friends. I don't. What do you mean? Look at the way the snowflakes swirl around the headlines. It's like stars and gal- You know what? I do like a little poeticness though. I do, on the other hand. Keep your eyes on the road, Mike. It's kind of beautiful. You know, let's get him the benefit of the doubt. It is kind of beautiful. You know, it doesn't snow here in Florida. So, I, I do think it's kind of beautiful when it, when it snows, I guess. I don't know. Dairy Mart. Okay. Yo, Harp, check that out. Moe's Pizza. Ooh, pizza sounds good right now. Screw this game. Now I want pizza. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. You know, Harp, I gotta tell you, these new GPS systems are something else. What year is this? This pizzeria is exactly where it appeared on my GPS. It's like we're living in the future, Mike. I'm so hungry, I think I could eat a whole pizza myself. Me too! Alright then, Harp Operation Pizza Pit Stop is a go. Prepare to land. Let's run from this man, bro. I can't even open the door myself. Come on in, Harp. You know what? Thank you. Thank you. This just in. Reports of a strong snowstorm coming towards Woodbury tonight. Residents are recommended to stay indoors and keep warm during this time. Let's okay, check there's a storm coming. Reporter. How's the weather out there, Phil? Oh, it's so cold out here. I, I can't feel my hands. Okay? Like, the studio should have really brought Wait, 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 wait. That new Is this Dante? I'm sure you'll be fine. Yo. You can have some Yo. Get back to the I know that voice from anywhere, bro. You cannot be serious. You know my doctor said not to drink any caffeine. Sounds like someone's having a bad day. Maybe you should <laughs> cool off. <laughs> you little shit. Why can't you go out here and deal with the snow instead of me? I've been working here for six years and I never get to report somewhere nice. Listen, Phil, I'm just clearly the better looking one. You can worry about where you'll report once you get that rhinoplasty. Rhinoplasty? Why would what I need rhinoplasty? What station is this? My face looks what channel is fine. this? 
You could also use some Botox while you're at it. Actually, maybe you should just work as a studio light engineer behind the camera. I think it would be better field of work for you. only got <laughs> your job because your sister Yo, works at the mixing board. He's kind of cooking him right now. If it wasn't for her. I'd like to see you work the ENG sometime. How dare you? I'm a certified news anchor. Certified? Yeah, my ass, okay? You didn't do Who's shit. Who's pushing me right How about now? I come by the studio and we settle this like men. Oh, yeah? Well, let's do it, punk. We'll be right back after this commercial break. Oh, are you exhausted and desperately? I will be here break? all day, bro. I will be here all day. I cannot, even though I want to. Okay. Evening, folks. Looks like the cold's got everyone craving pizza tonight. It sure does. Oh, sorry. I forgot I had to click the choices. You fine folks know what you want to eat. Pizza. We'll get three slices each. I'll go with pepperoni, cheese, and veggies. And for you, miss? Ooh. Okay. Mmm. Look at the most special. Margarita. And I gotta get my greens. Any drinks for you folks? That should cover us. Just like, uh, just the pizza today. Thanks. Alright then. Six hot slices coming right up. That'll be 22 fi- These better be the best pizza slices ever. Cause that's a lot of money. Oh shoot. Your order number is 27. Just grab a seat and we'll call you when your pizza's ready. Goodness, I'm starving. Should we talk to some pizza people? Should we talk to some pizza? Come home. I promise to sow more grass. Come and see for yourself. Burgers so delicious, your eyes will pop out of your orbit. See, that's how weird commercials are getting nowadays. I don't know if it's because people can't seem to uh, look at something for a second without something weird happening. So uh, this is this is what we're dealing with right now. How's your day going? Who are you? I'm Sydney. Look, Sydney. Bitch. We're just here to enjoy our pizza in peace. Thanks for understanding. Hope you enjoy your meal. Hope it's laced with rat poison. Don't. <sighs> it's fine. Hello. Oh, sir, you, you look like you've been through a lot. Is everything okay? You, you seem sad. <clears throat> and you don't even want to talk. It's fine. Bless your heart. How's the pizza? Oh, he looks old. Okay. Well, my dear, you absolutely can't go wrong with the pepperoni here at Moe's. Every bite reminds you of a story. So what brings you to Moe's? Just passing through. You've made a good choice stopping here. You know, old people love to talk, and, you know, if you listen, you might learn something, so we're just gonna listen. We're gonna just talk and listen. Uh, do you come here often? Oh, my dear, I've been coming to Moe's since 85. This place is full of memories for me. What's that weird noise, bro? Don't do this. Don't do this right now. Okay, we're not doing we're not doing any scares right now. Thanks. Though my daughter, bless her heart, she tries to keep me from eating too much pizza. Bad for a man my age, she says. She worries too much. Only have one of these heavenly slices about twice a month now. How much were you having? We don't ask questions. Who the hell is Who's behind me like that, bro? Well, it's nice chatting with you. Safe travels to you and your friend. It was nice talking to you, too. See? That was a great conversation. Too bad some, uh, people can't conversate, if that's even a word. How about you folks? How's your day going? 
It's going much better now after this pizza. Thanks for asking, how about you? Not too bad. It's our first time in the area. Um, which one's not as personal? Are you from here? Oh no, we're on our way to a conference in the next town over. Not too much farther, not too much farther to go. Oh, we love, we love the silent type. We just stop to eat whenever a place looks interesting. You know, that's how you find some hidden gems, I guess. This place definitely has a cozy vibe. Best decision of the trip so far. How about you, local or just passing through? Just passing through. Interesting. Um, I better get back to this pizza. You have a safe trip and be careful in the snow. You too. Okay, that was a bit awkward at the end, but uh, that's fine. Guess the... Uh, how you doing, my friend? Not bad. I'm as good as a man can be, my friend. You here for the pizza? No, just looking for a little help. Good luck. Hey, look. I can't even help myself. I ain't gonna help you. Okay. Let's, uh, let's get back to our seat. Or get in our seat. We've never got to the seat. Did we talk to him? Let's talk to the, let's talk to the person behind the counter. Get out of my way. Hello. Ooh. Is that him? Uh, do you have any recommendations? Get the cheese. I didn't get the cheese. What, what type of... I can't even say that on YouTube, can I? It smells so good in here. Okay. Oh. Oh, voice note. I love voice notes. I'm so sorry, you guys. Oh, oh you guys are going to hate me. I swear, I'll get on the road as soon as I can. But something last minute popped up. I'm not going to bore you with all of the details. The long and short of it is one of my clients needs a last minute change. Their payments are about the only thing keeping the lights on. I hate to leave so late, but I've got to keep them happy. I'll have this logo done before you know it, and be on my way. You're gonna leave me with Mike for how long? You didn't say. <sighs> Please be careful. I hate that you're leaving so late. Oh, that was me. I'm sorry. Uh, drive slow and don't worry. I'll make sure Harp stays up to let you in. I can do that myself. I can I can make sure I'm up. Thanks. Did you listen to Nora's voice message in the group? Yeah, I just saw. Looks like she'll be late. That's a bummer. I guess we'll have to start the fun without her. Mike, I'm getting some um pent up energy from you um so just to have a confirmation i need to ask what can we do don't act like you i don't know i don't know what you're talking about that's the problem just in time just in time just in time. Get away from this creep. Okay. Alright. Your folks are all set. Thank you. Oh, this looks good. This Those noises are... are not good. Oh damn, this pizza slaps. Can't believe Nora is missing out on this bomb-ass pizza. Oh 
god. It does look... Damn, Harpy, I actually eat the crap. The more you open your mouth, the more I just want to slap you. Of course, I eat the crust. It's wasteful. I guess, but you wouldn't really eat the- shut, shut the hell up. I'm done. I'm done with you. I'm about to walk in the snow instead of ride in the car with you. I'm about to do that. Hey there, my friends. Hello there. I saw y'all pull in the drive. Uh, what? I saw y'all pull and drive in that nice old truck. Um, that's right. Not to be a bother or anything, but I was heading down the road myself. Seems like we might be going the same direction. You're, you're not giving good vibes either. Y'all mind if I hitch a ride with you? First of all, not my car. Second of all, I don't know you. I, I met you literally like three seconds ago and you're not even here for pizza. Yeah, where's your car? Who needs a car when there are fine friends like you to pass the time with, sir? No. Y'all wouldn't even know I was there. Quiet as a church mouse and twice as nice. I'd rather have the church mouse. So what do y'all say? Care to give this free spirit a ride? No. No? Are you kidding me? Have you seen the snow out there? You want me walking down the road in this freezing weather? I'm sorry. You ain't too kind, are you? Just being safe, sir. And why didn't you talk, bro? It's your car. Does, this, does the pizza slap that much that you can't say anything? Well, that was weird. If it was so weird, why didn't you fucking say anything, Mike? You didn't even order anything. Exit. I'm just... Just trying to get through the night. Why not lick our fingers, too, at this point? We can burp? Uh. Uh. What? Oh, Nora. Drive slow and nope, that that was Mike, sorry. Heart XD, heart. Ugh. Okay. Um, guess we're Holy, that was great! Alright then, are you ready to hitch or are you ready to hit the road? Maybe we can beat the worst of the snow. Uh, are we close? In what way are we asking that? Um, let's see if my GPS is right. Should be about another hour. Give me the keys we're driving? Yo, okay. Harp, the weather is awful. Why don't you drive part of the way home? Uh, I'm gonna drive, uh, yeah, I'm gonna drive either way, so just, just let me go. I'm afraid of what type of break you're gonna give me, Harp. Give me the keys. Fine. There's one condition. What do you want, Mike? I get first choice of the bedrooms when, or if, we get there. Whatever. I'm kinda scared. You mother-loving piece of- You can beat me! Weird commercials, guys. Thanks to TikTok. 5.49 p.m. Good evening, Vermont. Oh, this God. Um, okay. Your hometown station, bringing you the best tunes to warm your hearts on this chilly night. As we embrace the first snowfall of the season, there's okay, nothing I wait. like oh, a perfect oh, wait. to set the mood. So oh, crap. Okay. Right at home. Coming up next, Be Sincere by Ned and Altus. Actually, I'm doing pretty good. Stay warm. I'm doing pretty Stay good. Stay tuned. Thank you. 
<gasps> Did you get your punchlines from a cereal box? Oh, what is this song though? I should have let Mike try. You should have got an Uber. I'm gonna have to get this song though. Don't fight, man. I'm trying to be something for nothing. You get some memories, cause there is plenty of me lurking in the streets. But you're certain that your purpose is surplus to listen to me. Like you cannot pick up the phone. You cannot even write back. You think this all we're living for. Isn't that sad? Oh my god. Okay. 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 Oh shoot, we missed a turn. Um It's fine. It's fine. Why are you looking at me like that, bro? That's right. Look away. No, I don't want you to take over. Let me not. They're a bit uh, wonky. They're a bit wonky, sorry. I like the words out of mouth, seems to light in my life. I'm connected to a heart like the moon and the tides. And besides, no one can take what a What radio out station is this? Because I think, Cause I, think I need this too. Way, that's no coincidence. Trying to be the best that I could be without no wishing that. Feeling like a plane, trying to soar in the sky. But without you, feel so hesitant. I can't lie. I'm trying to be a millionaire before I'm 25. Maybe I'm like halfway. Maybe I can make it there. I ain't trying to slow down because I'm trying to retire my mom and my old man. I don't worry about all the drama yeah yeah Wood i berry. keep it cool yay hearing lies man that ain't all there is to me i'm trying to feel your heart but writing on the shitty screen and i promise you will be about to strike but my life in the heart i have a so feeling that that's it i have a feeling that that's it but can get it if i try so i sit up in my room right reflecting okay. on my life i don't know where i'm going but i hope i get it right okay no 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 okay That's one, uh, bro, shut up, bro. We're here, great. My legs fell asleep, one second. It was a very cold night. It was a quaint little house in a quiet neighborhood. I don't like this music choice. Can we go back to the tunes like the car had? Or, or is this what we're stuck with? Aren't you going to get your bag? Oh, let me get it. Sorry. I was just excited to get out of this cold. Maybe you should be like a, a gentleman and 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 get and get my bag. How about that? Then maybe just maybe you can hit. Okay? Stop it. Ooh, this is this is kind of a nice house. What a great place. I knew we could count on you. It smells so nice in here. Right, but I really need to hit the john. Take your time, Mike. While I'm gone, can you put these groceries away? Should be enough space in the fridge. I got it. Guess we can just... The house was cozy and well furnished. We're not gonna check the house, actually. Let's check the house. Cause this is a horror game. Okay. None in here. You just you just never know. Ooh, upstairs. Let's see. I need to stock the fridge first. Harper. Fine, let's stock the fridge first, because that's important. Yo, how long are we- I'm sorry, didn't mean to do that either. How long are we staying here for? Because a whole carton of eggs? If we're staying for one night, we don't need all this food. But I, I guess like three people are staying here, so maybe, you know. 
Okay, that's that's everything, right? I I felt scared when you're walking towards me like that, sir. Please stop. Phew, sorry about that, Harp. Long drive and all that pizza really did a number on me. No worries, you know, everyone's gotta do a number two sometimes. Anyways, this place looks crazy nice. It's got that rustic charm you just don't see anymore. Yeah, it's cute. For sure. Hey, I really need to pee. I'll be back. You can go ahead. I'll start unpacking our, our bags. Why are you unpacking my bag? Hey, what if I don't want you to unpack my bag? Guess we're just gonna let him do that. Um, I hope there's Febreze or something in here, cause... Oh, God. Close the door, especially, especially now. Smell alone told me pizza had really done a number on Mike. Oh, yikes, dude. Oh yeah, we need to um, we need to let him know that we checked in. Okay, well, whatever. That works too. Okay, let's go. Mike, you gotta do better. Cause I would have broke your nose. Just saying. You feeling better after the drive? I'm good, wanna check out the house? S sounds good to me. Let's see what this place has to offer. After you. Um, well, there's really nothing over here. Kitchen. Storage, I guess. <laughs> oh, hey, you're here. You scared us. Oopsie Daisy, didn't mean to. Welcome to my home. Yo, we rented the house. Why are you here? I thought you were cool. This is not how our agreement went. What a lovely young couple. We're just friends. Oopsie Daisy, silly me. We didn't expect anyone to be here. Oh, um. I was out looking for my cat earlier, and I remember the TV has been on the fritz here. We don't need a TV, we just got our phones. Just thought I'd stop by and try to get it working again since the last few folks left a bad word for it. You know, they say treat your guests like family. My family doesn't go without a TV. Yeah, me too, Mike. We're agreeing on something, finally. Speaking of that, now that you folks are here, let me show you around my sweet home. Right now? I'd be a bad owner if I didn't give you the grand tour. Oh my god. Yo, um, host was a middle-aged man with nervous energy. Uh, here's our, well, here's your shower. That will thing up, I can't read, I'm so sorry. Here's your shower. That thing will make you feel like you're bathing under a waterfall in the Amazon jungle. Oh, the sink doesn't work, unfortunately. Not to worry. I'll get it fixed for you real soon. Let me show you the other bedroom now. You know, we can, we can, you know, tour it ourselves. This doesn't need any explanation. Look, Harp. This room has a nice-ass view. Both of you stop talking. Just stop. Actually, get out. I want it for myself. You think that's nice, mister? Wait till I show you the deck. Follow me now, please. Uh, it's not like I have a choice. This is a nice house. Rude. 
Anyway, this is enough. Holy smokes, this is incredible. Incredibly cold. Glad you folks like it. This is one of my favorite spots. The view of the creek is beautiful. It's a great spot for fishing, too. All right, folks, let's head back in before I catch cold here. Again? Is there something you want, Mike? Yo, this is, this is absolutely crazy. This is absolutely crazy. I'm stuck in a house with Mike and Rick. And they both seem like lunatics. What's he doing? <laughs> what is he doing? What are you doing, sir? You hit your head? Here's the storage room. If you need anything, tools, extra blankets, whatnot, it's all in here. If the power ever goes out, you can use this flashlight here on my right. Storms like these, you never know. Thanks, we will need the flashlight, definitely. Alright folks, let's head downstairs now. Sir, where's that flashlight? Thank you, we are holding on to this thing. We never know when we'll need- We'll never know when we need it. Alrighty, folks. I see you already stuck. Why are you looking at our stuff in the fridge, bro? You are invading our privacy that we paid for. Please get out. Respectably, get the frick out. I see you already stocked up the fridge with some tasty food. Get out! You see the knob? Turn the knob up for more cooling and down to cool it off. I tend to keep it low in the winter. The bill gets out of control. Speaking of winter, I better show you folks the water heater. It's just for one night. Just for one night. Just for one night. I don't like- I don't like this view of you, bro. You don't need to turn another light on. Um, nothing to worry about down here. Just the water heater and some old storage stuff. If it ever stops working, just hit the button at the bottom. The pilot light will fire right up, and you'll be back in business. Thanks. Hey, sir, uh, what's the deal with that room over there? Nothing you two need to concern yourselves with. What? Okay. I kinda use this basement as storage. Renters don't need this space. They really ought to keep upstairs. Okay, well, I was just curious. Let's uh, use this as a thumbnail, though. This, uh... Yeah. Caught in 4K. Thanks. Let's move on. Let's get out of here. Why'd you stop? Did I mention? Well, no. Maybe I ought to keep it to myself. No, you already started. Just get it over with. The fella I bought this house from, well, told me his mother died down here. Why would you tell me that while we're down here? You think this is a joke? You think it's funny? Are any of us laughing? No. Some guests have reported hearing voices at night. Said they, they could hear something shuffling around down here. Not to scare you folks off. Uh, but if I were you, I wouldn't really step down here. Yo, please, please, personal space. Does anyone know personal space in this game? And yeah, we're worth thumbnailing that too, actually. <laughs> the looks on your faces. <laughs> Come on now, I was just joking. At this point, my creep meter was quietly pinging around a 6 out of 10. 
for a good reason. Sir, I'm coming. Alrighty, folks. Snow's starting to pick up. I gotta hit the road now. Gotta find that damn cat. You shouldn't have showed us around. Please get out. By the way, what's the name on the book? There should be a choice saying, well, uh, why don't you check the, uh, rental, the renter's information, Rick? Right? It's Sydney. Ha! Sydney, that's right. A pretty name for a pretty girl. <laughs> oh my god, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Is it just me, or did that doom see super weird? Not the only one that seems super weird, Mike. Anyway, let's go and see if there's anything good on TV. Actually, I'm gonna take a quick shower. Cool, I'll find something to watch while you're there. <laughs> Let me know if it feels like you're underwater. Get out of here. What a weird out. Great, thanks. Um... Was there a shower in there, though? I don't know. We'll just look for one upstairs. That's definitely not it. Oh yeah, there we go. Under a, an Amazon jungle, rainforest, whatever. Like, get out of my face. It is a nice shower though. I, I, actually, the house is, is pretty golden. I didn't need to shower. Yeah, we just showered. We just did that. Put your clothes on before Mike wants to do something to you. Great. We close doors here, actually. Why you got the fishing pole? Mike. Mike, I know you're not about to fish and it's snowing outside. What's wrong with you? Were you dropped as a baby? This is not good. Hey, Harp. Check this out. I found this fishing rod in the shed. <laughs> God, no. Planning to catch dinner? No, just just say nothing. It's about time you see how good I am at fishing. I don't know, it's cold out there. Come on, Harp. What would this trip... What? You know... What would make this trip more epic than catching your own freaking dinner? We have groceries. It's not like we got no food, bro. I guess it could be fun. Oh, so you're stupid too, Harper. You're... You're... With him at this point. Hell yeah, follow me and there's another rod in the shed so we can both give it a shot and catch cold. Lovely, thank you. I guess we gotta put this down actually. Let's uh, come on Harp, it's this way. Get off me, bro. Okay, uh, we don't do that. Oh, buckets, there we go. Thanks. You know, it is pretty nice outside. It looks nice, but it probably doesn't feel too nice, actually. Do you want to grab the other fishing rod, Harp? I have no choice, so sure. I would love to. I'm not closing the door. You might get some uh, ideas. Oh, snap! I saw a killer recipe for baked carp. We'll need to catch three carp, though. You up for a challenge? You know, I'm always up for a challenge, sure. Well, first things first, we need the right bait for carp. Check out this bait information board. Whenever you're ready, grab a carp bait and let's head to the creek. We're gonna catch some carp, harp? Please don't rhyme ever again with my name. Let's see. She's cheese for fish. <laughs> um, sure. Put on the hook. Okay. 
closed doors here. Come on, Harp, it's this way. Thanks. I got lost. I was so lost without you. Thanks, Mike. I can't believe we're doing this. I can't believe we're doing this in, like, below zero weather. I hope those carp are biting today. Me too. Me too. How do I do this? Is it like Animal Crossing or uh, Stardew Valley rules? Because this will be this will be easy. Uh, what? A and D? Oh, it's not. It's not those rules at all. Actually, this is actually pretty. This might be harder than I thought. It's not a carp. That's a bluegill. But we did say we're up for a challenge, so I guess this is Oh, this is this is pretty easy. Yay me, go me, keep. They say whenever there's one carp, there's always more. Please shut up. Oh, that was far. Is that even in the water? I guess it is. Who the fuck is that? That's not creepy at all. I guess let's just let's just keep fishing. A bluegill. If I see another bluegill, I don't know what I'm gonna do. <sighs> Woo, just one more. He's not doing a single thing. We need three carp. I'm getting three carp. So what are you doing? Why are we here? Did you just want to watch me shiver? Does that get you going, Mike? Yeah, I'm so done. I'm so done with him. And you know, I don't even know why we decided to go on this trip. We could just take Nora and have a girls' night. But no, we have to take Mike. He probably definitely has a crush on you. Great, thanks. All right, Harp, looks like we got, we? You mean I, I got three carp. All your ass was playing with water. Do you wanna head back and throw these in the oven? Yeah, let's do it, go ahead. You get the hell away from me, you are, you're pissing me off. You are so pissing me off. It's not even funny. Uh, I need to- No, you don't. You need to go inside. You need to go inside. That's what we need to do. How, how do we throw this shit? Bye. 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 Was the fridge always open? Uh, what's that ambience? While I'm cleaning the fish, do you mind prepping the marmalade? Um, sure, why not? Just take a bowl and throw it in, put a bunch of ingredients, and, and you're on your way. On it, thanks. Didn't we have two milks here? Unless, you know, it's probably... It's probably him or something, I don't know. Okay, um, okay, there's a list right here. Salt, right, pepper, okay, paprika, Italian seasoning, okay. Ginger garlic paste, what? Ginger garlic paste? Okay, 
Um, olive oil and yogurt. Extra virgin olive oil. Yummy yum yum. Um, this says frozen yogurt. Is it yogurt or frozen yo- Yum! Frozen yogurt. Do you mind throwing the fish and the marmalade in a casserole while I chop these veggies on it? Thanks. Where's the fish? Fish right here. One fish. Two fish. Don't, don't, don't do that. Those carp are gonna taste amazing. While we wait, for it to cook, how about we play a game? I saw some in the room next to the living room. Which one? Just grab whatever catches your eye. Can't wait to see what you pick. I saw some in the room. Okay. I. Great. I'm going. I don't like this being open. Let's see. Is that a Ouija board? Okay, we're not we're not doing that. We're not we're not doing that right now. How about chess? I love a good game of chess, Mike. Not feeling I see what you're trying to do. Not feeling that one. How about something that So a Ouija board? Are we going to get the Ouija board? After that man said what he said down there? You know... I keep questioning why I'm here. Like, why am I here with this man? You know, whispers in the dark seems kind of scary, right? I don't... Oh, yes you do, Mike. You know. Maybe something with a bit more suspense. You freaking bastard. <laughs> yeah. Ouija board. Can't wait. Yippee. Watch him jump for joy. Oh my god, a Ouija board is gonna be great, Harper! Oh my freaking goodness. Oh snap, is that a Ouija board? Holly told me how she contacted her dead grandma through one of these boards. Can't stand that spiritual bull. Didn't, weren't you just in the car talking about intergalactical shit? You have no room to talk, sir. Hey, remember how- yes, I do. That's- this is- this is not the answer. Let's go. Since- since you wanted this. And the piano plays in the back. Just a nice touch. Watch out for spider. So now you're trying to scare me. And this is not going to end up the way you want it to. I'm not going to be cuddling against you. You know, saying, oh, I'm so scared, Mike. I'm so scared. No. Oh, he's ready. He is so ready. You know what will make this even spookier. Turn off all the lights and see if this thing really works. This is the this is the dumbest crap. This is this is dumb. How do we where's the switch? Oh. Oh great, this isn't creepy at all. Anyways, do you know how this works? No. So here's how it works. First, we place our fingers slightly on the planchette. Planchette? I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna pronounce it like that, whatever. We have to ask questions, and the spirits, if there are any, will move the planchette to spell out these answers. Or at least that's how Holly told me. One more thing, Harp. 
never take your fingers off the planchie until we say goodbye. Otherwise, we might tick off some spirits, she said. Okay. All right, then you go first. Are there any spirits that want to talk to us? Ooh. Um. It's moving by itself, though. Okay. Um. I'm just. I'm just not gonna move it. <sighs> no way. Are you? No. That wasn't me. Okay, I got one too. Go ahead. How's the act? We're gonna get killed, bro. We are gonna get got. Oh my god. Be respectful. I don't even know what's saying. Um, are you friendly? That's a, that's a nice question. I'm sure they'll answer truthfully. It's going towards no, so this is not good. Your turn. Come on, buddy, give us a sign. Let us know you're here. Oh my god, I do not like this. I don't like this. I really don't like this. Oh my god. Bro, he literally just left us. He literally just left us so quick. Like, we were just a second thought. This is crazy. And this guy seems like he wants to... He ain't getting any. There's some freaky shit going down there, Harp. Going on down there, Harp. That was weird. Um, the weird part is that you ditched me. What the hell, Harp? I figured that you would move your ass, too. It'd be nice if you checked. Have you ever heard of fight or flight? Sydney, I'm sorry, okay? Just let me hit tonight. Hell no. Hell no. Oh, that... I... I threw that. Sorry. Yikes, dude. <laughs> I think our show is about to come on. You want to watch TV and eat? Let's let's do it. You're not going to get my plate? Yo, this guy is crazy, dude. This guy is crazy. This has got to be the weirdest the weirdest guy I've ever I've ever spent time with, bro. Selfish. You couldn't get my plate? Oh my god. I would have got your plate. He makes me so mad. You didn't even turn on the TV, bro. You could have at least did that if you were first, you know, the first to get here. I guess we just tap on the TV. A dish only for experienced cooks. It requires a lot of patience and skill. What you will need is gasoline is that for easy ramen no no wait wait this wait 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 really soothes the soul that is believe like a high end cleanse yo this is crazy they got Dante. they got really in here bro make sure not to use whole gasoline since it's really bad for you maybe use 2% or half and half do not use diesel so after letting the gasoline come to a boil, we can Wait, put what? in our ramen. Ramen I'm using some stuff with I gasoline. Found in my grandmama's basement. But you can use whatever kind you like. This ramen will taste fantastic. Maybe they're telling me how to once kill the gasoline Mike over here. fully soaks into the noodles. It's actually kind of scientific. 
Bill Nye who? <laughs> the gasoline molecules merge with the noodle molecules, and they taste very good. Now that this is cooking, we can check on our cake. Um, uh, if your oven <clears throat> catches on fire, uh, make sure to put it out with the fire extinguisher. <laughs> well, damn. Uh, uh, damn, that's burnt. Uh, I I'm not eating this. <laughs> but, but, but not to worry. I know someone who will. Yo, Grandma! Yo, I made you food! No, 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 it's not, it's not poison. It's not poison. Look. <laughs> Bye, Grandma. Stay in your room. I don't want you wandering around the house again. Get back in there. <laughs> okay, I'm glad she ate that up. I'm worried. I wouldn't want any food I'm to worried. go to waste. Anyways, I guess we can still enjoy our gasoline ramen. Which is ready to Guess we're just serve. gonna let that slide. I hope y'all enjoy eating this. Harp that was some damn fine I food. Know. Twice as good Let's as it. Eat. It was really good. We may no, no. Hey, anyways, I need to check my emails real quick. I left my laptop upstairs. Go, go, do what you want to do at this point. I'll do the dishes. You know, you could have put your dish in the sink. Could have, could have done that. Whatever. I guess, you know, that's a woman's job, right? Okay. Dishes are clean. Um. Ooh, crossword puzzles. Oh. Don't do this. Don't do this right now. Can I come upstairs? I... Mmm. 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 Mm. This better not be a joke or a way to... Mmm. Okay, it's not this bad room. Of course, it's it's the one it's the one in the other side of the house. Of course, of course it is. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Mike, Mike, first of all, you're way too close. Second of all, what the fuck? Why would you do that? Lucky I didn't, you know what? Let's break his nose. Just shut up. No, it wasn't. It's not cool. Come on, it was, no. The next round, this is not a game. How about a game of, there should be a no option. You know, I think I think the maker of this game forgot another option here because there ain't no way I'm playing with this guy. Fine. All right, you're on, I'll count to 10. I decided to hide in the, b Harper. Harper, really? Are you, are you dumb too? I think I think we already established this. Yeah, you might be a bit dumb. Cause there ain't no way after what happened you wanna hide in the basement. Like, who is Harper? That's what I'm wondering too. Cause if if you got friends like Mike, it can't be good. Where where do I hide? Where do I hide? I decide to hide and look under the stairs. It's great. Okay.
Oh. Lord have mercy. Uh huh. Got you. Ha ha. That wasn't even a challenge. I figured that you would be good at this since I never find you in the city. There's a reason for that. Alright, it's my turn to hide now. You better cl I don't want to look for you. I really don't. I don't know where... <sighs> One Mississippi. Two Mississippi. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, I'm... No. None of that extra crap. Let's just go ahead and... Let's get out of here, <laughs> actually. That's... that's the first thing that we should do. I don't know where the hell he is, and I don't like this music. I don't. Okay, it's definitely not in here. Um, let's save outside for later, cause I I don't really feel like I don't really feel like looking there. That seems like a lot of work right now. Okay, definitely not in here. I actually didn't need to go in there to see that. Um, nope, can't open that. Okay, no. Got you. Hang on, Harp, I think I heard some- Bro, don't- don't do this. Cause then I will break your nose. Seriously. Seriously. You're gonna try this again? No kidding, Sydney. I really heard something sliding up there. Didn't you hear? No, I did not. I swear on my life, I heard something. I see this attic access door in here. Are you gonna go up and 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 uh, see what what's up? Are you going to check it out? You're taller than me. Why don't you go? I think uh. uh why are we here? Why are we... Why are we in this cabin with him, bro? This is not good. I think uh, my shoulders are too broad to fit through there, Sydney. but one of us really should look. Where are you hiding these brush? <laughs> Seriously, Sydney, I don't think I would fit through. Use that step stool behind you to climb up. This is... This is bad. This is absolutely bad. This is absolutely bad. And and it has a meter here too. I'm sure we won't need this for anything. Uh 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 where's my flashlight? Can we go back down? Oh, no. Why is it why do you have this man? Just throw it out at this point, bro. <laughs> Is that a kitty? Oh, so cute. So cute. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm sorry guys, I gotta do this. I love cats. Oh, okay. Okay. Mm. It was only a cat. Actually, let's just keep this on. It's not my electric bill. <laughs> There we go. Huh. Sydney, are you okay? What was up there? Looks like you aren't the only- Yes, we're saying that. What do you- What do I mean by that? It was just a cat. Oh, that's a relief. I was worried for a minute. I think she was hungry. Oh yeah, maybe we can give her that one, uh, other carp. After I come and find you again. That's nice. Exit. This is, this is unbelievable. I decide to hide in the tool shed? It's too cold for that. Really smart, really, really smart. How do I crouch, see? Great. Might be better. Oh, 
Like, is this fun to him? Like, we, we could be doing anything else. We could be doing, well, not, not anything else, but we could be doing a lot more stuff than this. Like, read a book? There was a crossword puzzle? There were other games. Other board games. You know, at this point, I want him to find me. Maybe I don't. Ah, there you are. Uh-huh. Damn, heart. Took me a while to figure out you left the house. I'm getting tired. Look, I'll hide in the house. We're headed back anyway. You find me and then we'll, we'll go to bed. Hey. don't appreciate it all okay let's just let's just see <clears throat> Mikey who are you not in here okay what's that what's that what's that What's that? Okay. He wouldn't he wouldn't hide in the I don't think he would hide in the same spot. No. Nope, 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 nope. What's going on? What happened? Rick! Why are you still here? Get out! Well, hey there! Why the hell are you in here again? I'm fixing the faucet! You got a problem with that? I mean, he did tell us, sort of, right? I've never seen anyone fix a faucet with a hammer before! You know what? That's pretty clever. Yeah, that's a really good observation, Mike. You ever fixed many faucets yourself, young man? Didn't think so. So I'd imagine you don't know what tools you need. How long have you been here? Just got here a couple minutes ago. If you heard anything before that, it must have been that old lady, remember? Heh heh heh. Old lady? Um, fix it tomorrow? You're asking me to leave, miss? Yes! Go! Bye-bye! No, Rick, she's being polite. We rented this house and would like to have it to ourselves. I... We don't really want to call law enforcement. No, Mike should definitely handle this. Handle something, right? Ain't no cops in Woodbury, son. Oh, so we're screwed. We're screwed. Oh my god. You think they're gonna arrest me, the homeowner, for fixing a faucet? I was just doing some work. If you can't handle that, then it's your problem, not mine. Ugh. Then, then give me our money. Well, give me my money back. I don't care about Mike, you know? Fuck him. Give me my money back. You know what? If you fucks don't like me fixing the faucet, then I'll leave you to it. Bye. I'll follow you out. Bye. Leave. Scram. Don't come back. Bye. Dumb bitch. <clears throat> After locking the door, we debated on what to do. We agreed that there was something off about Rick from the start. It seemed like he enjoyed making excuses to come over unannounced. 
In the end, we decided Rick was weird, but probably harmless. We attributed his behavior to an extreme lack of social awareness. <laughs> mm, excuse me. Ooh, excuse me. Sorry. Look, we already drove all the way out here. Let's just enjoy ourselves, Mike said. But by this time, I was feeling really tired. I decided to get some rest. Finally, no more hide-and-seek kindergarten games. It was 11 p.m. I wonder who that is. It better not be Mike. It better not be Mike, I swear to goodness. There is no way he's asking for a cookie. He's, he's not asking for cookies now. Oh my god. Harp, are you still awake? Hard to sleep when someone's knocking on my door. Do you mind if I come in? i just like to talk about something. Sure. You know, can we open this door? Yeah, just keep the door open. The storm is starting- Ooh, you hear that? Yeah, the storm's starting to get really bad. I can hardly see the truck in the driveway. Hope Nora's okay. She'll be fine, Cindy. Don't you worry. I'm here to keep you safe. There is no way the person that ran so fast while playing with a Ouija board, leaving me down in the basement, is saying that he'll keep me safe. Hell no. At this point, Anya can do a better job than you. Uh, what? Hey, it's no problem at all. Guys are supposed to watch over people they care about. Just say nothing. What a day, huh? This wasn't exactly how I thought our getaway was going to go, Sydney. It's been a strange day. Can you believe that guy? He just keeps wandering around the house like he owns the place. He does own the place, technically, but... I kind of wish he would cut it out. I thought you may be scared in here by yourself. Oh, I mean, I'm a little freaked out. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh no, he really trying it. He really trying it. He really trying it, bro. And it's not gonna work. You know what? No, 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 no. Leaving me already. Yes, I'm, I'm left. I have left yesterday. I'm going, I'm going. Something tells me I'm gonna have to go up there. Oh my God, this is bad. This is so bad. Don't you have- There's another perfectly good room, Mike. It's calling your name. Oh my god. Harp, you know? I've missed this. <laughs> Us just talking, it's been too long. You know? You don't have to sleep in the- Yo! You don't have to sleep alone tonight if- I want to. I love sleeping alone, actually. Ooh, would you be doing this with Nor- What's their relationship? Is this man two-timing? Yo! He's thinking about it. He's like, mm, you, you may be right, but I don't care. You act like you don't remember our trip to Oregon? Pretty awkward? It didn't start- Yo! No. 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 Mike, we had a lot to drink. Things happen. Oh, so she is an idiot. Oh my god. You know, when people say, oh man, well, I, I was drunk, I, I, I didn't, I didn't really want to. Bro, when you're drunk, when alcohol is involved, the truth comes out. So if you wanted to bang, <laughs> well, <laughs> you're gonna bang without thinking about the consequences. And now I'm thinking poor Mike, cause after that, he's probably like, wow, you know, Let's have a relationship. Let's have babies. Let's get married, Harper. 
or something like that. He, he seems like a, a childish dude, but whatever. Whatever. So, this guy is not all in the wrong. They're both idiots. Oh my god. They sure did. I'm hoping that they can happen again. I guess I've been meaning to talk to you about that. You just let me worry about the details. I don't think this is a good time. I think that was Nora, actually. Guys? SOS, I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury, and my stinking tire just blew out. It's snowing, and I'm on the side of the road on Highway 11 near Killington. There's a sign by the side of the road. It's hard to see. I, I think it says Kent's Pond. The snow is no like idea. half of Thank goodness you stepped in, bro. Or I don't know what type of video this would be. What a timing, huh? But I guess we can't leave Nora stranded. Um, yeah, better get ready. No, Cindy, you stay here and get some sleep. There's no sense in both of us freezing our asses off. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. You're in pajamas and I'm still dressed. You should settle in and I'll go help Nora. That's really nice, Mike. I always love. Sorry. <laughs> I always like doing nice things for you. We are stringing this guy along, bro. You you guys are made for each other, actually. Probably. Please be careful. We'll finish talking about this later, okay? Get some good rest and stay warm. You need to talk about it. You need to, at this point. Because it's, it's just building up. He's pent up, bro. And it's your fault. <laughs> it's your fault, bro. Hey, why don't you get some rest while I'm... He's actually really worried, bro. He's actually really worried. Um, yeah, you're sure it's safe? Don't worry, I've driven worse. Besides Nora... Is probably freaking out more than you right now. Yeah, you're probably right. Look, make sure you take extra care. Maybe he's not all bad. Art? You sound like my dad. You childish bastard. How about a hug? You know, he might die. We have no idea. Just hug him, man. Sweet dreams, get some rest, Sydney. Drive safe. Now I'm home alone. I told myself things would get better if I just get some rest. Nora always knew how to cheer me up and I needed it more by the minute. With her arriving soon, I decided to rest in the meantime. Oh, demon hours. Okay, demon time. Why do I have a feeling it's not Mike? Why do I have a feeling it's not Mike? Someone was at the front door. Oh my god, I don't, I don't feel like doing this. 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 Oh my god. Okay! Yo! Chill! Uh-uh! Yeah, I'm definitely not- <gasps> Okay, what the hell? Whoa, okay. Isn't that that guy from the pizza place? He's stalking me right now. No. I saw you there, my friend. Please open the door. I'm freezing to death out here. And he won't leave me alone. He won't leave me alone. Please go away, sir. I don't feel like talking to you. Do you have any idea what time it is? Look, friend, I know it ain't ideal banging on your door in the middle of the night, but I'm in a bad spot here. I was counting on a ride from some friends, but they're running behind, 
and won't be here for two more hours. You can sit on the porch while you wait. Thanks. But I was hoping that no. No, he's he's uh he's out of luck. I am not letting him. Yep, and a story. And he's got anger issues. Are you freaking kidding me? You're gonna let me freeze to death out here? Yes. Absolutely. I didn't make you go hiking the snowstorm. Should have known you'd be as big of a bitch here than you were back at the. Yeah, he knew exactly where I was going. He followed me. He fought. And you know what? That was him. Remember when he was walking while we were fishing out there? That was him. This is crazy. This is crazy. You think I didn't see you and your little boyfriend fishing in the creek earlier? Yeah. Creepy bitch. I figured maybe you'd give me a chance this time, but it looks like you're still unkind. Get out or I'll call the cops. Why did we come to why did we come to this town? There ain't no cops around here. This is not the break from work I need. Speaking of, I don't see your fella's truck out here, bro. We're screwed. I'm dialing right now. Fine. Suit yourself. Please go away. Go. Go. Oh my god. Bye. Bye bye. What are you waiting for? But let me tell you something. You'll get what's coming to you for leaving me out here. Karma's a bitch, my friend. We're not friends. In any life. We're not friends. Let's make this clear. Bye. The man at the door seemed irrelevant compared to- You are not going to sleep. We are not going to sleep. Oh my god. How can she sleep with this? How can she sleep with this shit going on? This is crazy. But I guess, you know... Harper's all for her sleep schedule. I guess her sleep schedule is her life right now or something. I don't know. This is crazy. I couldn't keep my eyes open. Yeah, we're sleeping. No, 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 no. What happened? Did someone throw a snowball? Yo, someone. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my god, there's someone. You met driving down there. Just being on the door and started threatening me. I'm pretty scared and think I hear him moving around outside the house. Can you can you come, please? Oh my god. This is this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Oh my god. Something. This is something. Oh, at least it's a good flashlight. Oh, great. Hey, let's see who's at the door. Oh, look, it's Rick. Hi, Rick. Seeing him was a relief. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, 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 yo. Pause. That's not what you came here for. That's not why I called you. <laughs> What's going on? Oh, thank God you're here. Yeah, I came as quickly as I could. I wouldn't worry about him anymore. Uh, can I, like, not cry? There we go. Now we can... 
By the way, where's your friend? Anyone that says, hey, where's that guy? Especially if they're male. You're the only female here. It's, it's not good. You're not in a good spot. Uh, he should be back soon. Or... He should be back soon. Yeah. Hmm. So you're all alone here right now. Yeah, but my friends... Nope. Let's just not... He's looking around? Bro. No. 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 Rick. This isn't good. This... I'm not getting good vibes from you, actually. I'd rather have Mike here. I'd rather have Mike here instead. Storms like this bring out all kinds of folks. Not all of them know when to stay away. Okay, whatever. Rick. This guy ain't Rick. This guy ain't Rick. I knew something was up when he asked what the name on the rental thing is. Bro. Absolutely. And he's coming over. Fuck, 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 fuck. Get away from me, bro. Get away from me, bro. Get away from me. Get away. Get away. Get away. Get away. I can't go upstairs. What? So we gotta confront him. Maybe if we shine this in his face. Ooh, you know what? Let's turn this off. Oh! Everything okay, miss? Yeah! Awfully late for texting, isn't it? Who are you talking to? Um, it's my friends. They're almost here. Is that so? Yeah, thank you for stopping by, though. I'll be fine now. You can head back. You're sure about that? Yeah, I just overreacted. Maybe you should, maybe you should stick around. Make sure everything's okay. You need to. You need to. You need to go. With your breast thing. What did you just say? Confront? Oh my god. This is my fucking house. I will leave when I want to. Get out of here. There's no cops here. Apparently there's no cops in Woodbury. So, what do you want? I want what's mine. What do you mean by that, Rick? I can't even call you Rick. What do I call you? No name? And you? You're trespassing. You need to leave right now. I don't think so. If anyone's leaving this house, it's one of us. Bro has a murder plot. No, 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 no. Where do we go? Where do we go? Where do we Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah. 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 That's what you think. Okay. Let's think about this. We probably gotta go in the basement. Actually, we probably gotta go to the places where we played hide and seek. Cause there's really no, no nowhere in the house. You could try to go in the in the tool shed, right? But he's gonna eventually find you because you gotta go back in the house. So uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know anymore. Yeah. We're going near the basement right now, sir. We're going near this door right here. Mm -hmm. 
storms like this bring out all kinds of folks. Not all of them, yeah. No. We're going right here. Oh, uh, yeah, that's not me, sir. Uh, ma'am, you, you better, uh, you better run. Better run. Hi, Rick. No name. Everything okay? Yeah, who are you? Yeah, yeah, no. Move! Are you fucking kidding me, bro? This is crazy. This is crazy. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. It's just. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. Mm. Fuck. <laughs> Screwed. Yeah, who are you? Yeah, yeah. No, we're running. We're running. Bye. Are you freaking kidding me? Run, 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 run. Go to the door. Go to the door. Oh my fucking goodness. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh shit. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Oh fuck. I didn't know he broke the door, bro. I didn't know he broke the knob. This is some bull crap. And he's fast, too. It's like, when I'm old, I want to be like that. I mean, not not completely, because, you know, what he's doing is, is creepy. But physically, yes. Absolutely. <gasps> Stop texting me, bro. What? Wait, wait, wait. No! The door! The doorbell was right! So we're not in the clear. We're not, we're not in the clear. We're not in the clear yet. Okay, so...
We have to stay, no. Because my guess is that's gonna happen every time we go out of the closet and downstairs. So. I guess we gotta go back in the, in the, in the closet. Or the basement, right? Right? Cause we were there too, right? Okay, we're gonna try that. We're gonna try that. We're gonna try that. We're gonna try that. Is it safe to go down? We can't run. I'm guessing it's it's safe. Hopefully. And they just don't give me the run around. this strength and this bravery when we were here together huh Mike it's fine I told them everything that happened after Mike had left Rick had called the cops the storm had quieted down by the time they arrived and of course the man was nowhere to be seen On our drive back, the whole night played over and over in my head. We think that the man we saw secretly lived in the cabin when it wasn't being used. That room in the basement. Yep, that makes sense. And planned on robbing us during our stay. But the cops seemed to think there was more intent behind this man's action aside from rob. Yes, that man was mental. Uh, Rick asked me what the man looked like and after that he didn't ask any more questions we think he knew more than he was letting on i mean he had to know something like there are there are different people that we should be looking at in this situation this is unacceptable at least we got a refund right hey there's the songs wait a second let me you know, I can just get him offline. Berlizzi and I'm Dante. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Was that the opening? Is, did the basement have something to do with it? Oh, probably, yeah. Of course. We were in the basement, actually. Silly me. Um, could we have opened it? Good game. Definitely had a lot, not a lot of scares, but a good amount of scares. It was definitely, it was definitely less scary than I, than I thought, but it was definitely good. It was definitely a good amount of scares.
Lord have mercy. Anyway, guys, that was Fears to Fathom Episode 5, Woodbury Getaway. I will be playing all the episodes, so if you want to see that and if you want more content like this, please comment, subscribe, like, share, burn it, do whatever you want. It's greatly appreciated, and I hope to see you in the next video. My headphones are slipping off my head. Thank you, guys. Love you. Ha <laughs> ha.